Hey, I'm Lee Ryan. This is Around My House, and today I'm going to show you my flare camera. Okay, so I have a flare one, and this will go with a smartphone. In my case, I have the Samsung 7S Edge. Um, so the box comes with, of course, the camera, and you have a holding case for the camera. So that way you can go and stick it in, whoops, <laughs> put it in the correct way. So it's going to go in here, and uh, that way you can carry it around, and to help you carry it around, we have this, which will attach um, there, and we also have a USB cable, and we're going to need this to um, charge it. Interestingly enough, they don't give you a charger, but, I mean, come on, we all got so many freaking USB chargers nowadays, it shouldn't be a problem. Uh, plus, I think you could probably just plug it into your computer, if worst case. So, you have your charge uh, port there, or USB for charging. You have um, your on-off button there, and that will just plug into your, your smartphone. Now, in my case, I have the OtterBox case on it, and that makes it kind of difficult to actually get it plugged in correctly. Luckily, they give you two attachments. So we have the E and we have the R. So the E is an extender, um, and R is an extender but reversed. And this is kind of handy, so because uh, you may not realize it, but uh, the USB on your phone, some phones go one way and some phones go the other way. Um, so in my case, I can use the reg the extender, and um, so we stick the extender in there. And now we can hook up the camera. Oops. So there's the camera. So we're going to log into our phone. Um, so we have the Flare 1 app. Go into the Flare 1 app. And now we're going to want to turn this on. So. Now we can go, alright, so when we get in the camera, we can see, look around in infrared, and um, if we go look at one picture I took, we can see, so you can see it in regular visible light, and you can see it in infrared. Um, because we have both a uh, infrared and visible light camera. Uh, so it's not using the camera on the phone, it's using one in there. Oops. So um, you can see. Um, also, if we, uh, here's a video. Alright, so here we have the door. And we can see the cold air coming in underneath the door. We can also see that we apparently don't have insulation on the one side of the door. Um, so, um, it has the, when you record uh, videos, you can have audio with it, which um, the Seek apparently didn't have. Um, and so I went with the Flare 1 instead. So that's the camera. Uh, I'll have some uh, video clips and pictures at the end here. Um, like my videos. And uh, thanks for watching. And we'll see you next time. Thanks.
So here's the inside of the, the house. And uh, so yeah, we can kind of see the studs. Also kind of looks like we may be missing some insulation on this wall here. <laughs> I mean, look, there's a stud. Uh, you got studs around the window. Here's a, what looks like a stud there. And another one there. And a uh, similar thing on this one. Oh, look, there we go. So this is interesting. So we got the ground we're measuring at uh, freezing or a little below freezing. Um, there's a tree at 3 degrees C. And um, this is where my outside thermometer is, which we're measuring now oh, just under 4 C. So, um, the thermometer is probably reading a bit high if the ground is is like below freezing. Hmm, interesting.